Crohn's disease is an inflammatory bowel disease. It's caused by chronic inflammation of the gastrointestinal tract. There are some similarities in symptoms of Crohn's disease to another type of inflammatory bowel disease called ulcerative colitis. The main difference is that Crohn's disease can be inflammation in any part of the gastrointestinal tract, but ulcerative colitis only affects the colon and rectum. You might be wondering what the gastrointestinal tract is. This is a system of organs that take in food, digest it for energy and nutrients, and then release the waste products. The symptoms of Crohn's disease vary, but it depends on which portion of the gastrointestinal tract is being affected. The main symptoms are cramps in the abdomen, fever, fatigue, weight loss, loss of appetite, ulcers in the mouth and swollen gums. Your doctor can do some tests to help diagnose you if you have Crohn's disease. The first is a barium anema. This is a special x-ray of the large intestine. A colonoscopy is another way to diagnose Crohn's disease and this is a form of imaging of the colon. A CT scan of the abdomen can be done. And another way is the upper GI series, which is a procedure where your doctor uses x-rays, fluoroscopy and a liquid called barium to view the upper gastrointestinal tract. In terms of treatment of Crohn's disease, unfortunately there is no treatment. Symptoms can be intermittent, so sometimes you may be feeling okay, and then other times you may have a flare-up of symptoms. The goal to treat Crohn's disease is to manage your symptoms and suppress them to reduce incidences of flare-ups. It's also advised that you look after your diet, nutrition and stress management. In terms of diet, a well-balanced healthy diet is important. You would need to eat smaller quantities of food throughout the day rather than big bulky meals, increasing water intake, avoid greasy foods, avoid heavy fatty foods, and if you've already identified the food types which cause your flare-ups, you may need to actively try and avoid them. Some people have low tolerance to dairy products, so avoiding these foods can help. Some of the medications to treat Crohn's include cortisone or steroids to reduce inflammation, immune system blockers to reduce the immune reaction which causes inflammation. Sometimes antibiotics are given to reduce the bacterial overgrowth in the intestine. Stress is a key factor in managing Crohn's disease. High amounts of stress can cause flare-ups of Crohn's disease. The reason this link occurs, it's not fully understood, but managing stress levels can reduce Crohn's symptoms. Crohn's disease can increase your risk of colon cancer. And another thing that's noticed is some may have ulcerations in the mouth due to Crohn's, which, which look like this. If you do develop these lesions in the mouth, it's best to keep the area clean, perhaps with warm salty rinses. They tend to clear away on their own, but it's best to have them looked at by your dentist. So if you've made it to the end of the video, leave a 100 emoji as a comment so I know you've made it to the end of the video. If you have any questions, comment them below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as possible. And as always, leave a like and subscribe if you've liked this video.